It's All You Can Vegas. Hey everybody, it's Derek and Catherine, and we are here at the Ace Buffet at the Palms in Las Vegas. Let's see what there is to eat. There are a lot of food stations here at the Ace Buffet, but we're headed straight to the meat. Like a grill. Yeah, there's, there's real fire back there where they are really grilling. Got some fish here and collard greens. There go the collard greens. Roast chicken. Some mac and cheese. Looks like they have turkey and sirloin. Those both look pretty good. Can I get some sirloin and some turkey, please? Thank you. Thank you. Hi, uh, can, can I get a piece of sirloin finished on the grill? Thank you. Thank you. We got some sauces here, chimichurri, mm -hmm. horseradish. I'm gonna get some creamy horseradish for yeah. me. Do you want any? No, I don't think so. Okay. Awesome, thank you. And there you got okay. yours. Steak finished on the grill. Look yeah, at that. nice and hot. Some green bean casserole, some corn, and some roasted vegetables. But this is just the beginning. We have the hearth, and down there the sweet and light for desserts. Roasted salmon. Look yeah, at that. That was really good. They have Thai seafood curry. They have a birria ramen. I am absolutely getting this. Thai seafood curry and birria ramen. Totally getting this. Great. Thank you. I think I'm gonna try this salmon. Oh, that looks good. Yeah. Vegetable pizza. Cheese pizza. Some cheesy bread. And pepperoni pizza, which looks pretty good. Might have to get a slice of that. It's pretty tempting. Okay. Oh, is it what, a pasta station? Yeah, the Build Your Own Pasta oh, Station. Oh, Build Your Own Pasta Station. Let's take a look at how you can do it here. Chicken, shrimp, sausage, tomato, spinach, bell peppers, cheese, mushroom, onion. Wow. And you can pick between shells and spaghetti. Oh, I see. Uh -huh. Shells and spaghetti. Maybe I should try. Yeah, you should try it. Maybe. Some shrimp and spaghetti. You want any toppings for you? No, uh, maybe tomatoes, just a fresh tomato. You want tomato? Yeah. Body? No? No. Very okay. simple, just very simple, yeah. That's fine. That's, That's it, yeah, yeah. So I'll put my for you? Sure. Ooh. What do you want, Papa? What? I only have a mile. Mile. Nice. Yes. White wine in your pasta? Sure. Yeah, okay, that little white wine. Nice. You want an alfredo or marinara? What can I have? Uh, maybe a little marinara. Chicken. 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 Putting some sauce in on the side. Oh my god, this looks good. It smells really good. It smells really good. Parmesan cheese? Do you want parm? No cheese. There's the spaghetti going in. Wonderful. Thank you very much. Thank you. Okay. Wow, that looks incredible. That's Fresh great. pasta. All right, let's take this stuff back to the table because I'm going to run out of hands. <laughs> I know, but, there's more meat over oh, here too. There is more meat here in the smoke and fire section. Oh, it smells really good. There's pork oh. shoulder and brisket. Ah. And look, there's candied sweet potatoes and some baked beans. But yeah, that pork shoulder and brisket looks incredible. Wow. We're going to have to come back. All right, I got to try this pasta. It's fresh made. It's piping hot. There's shrimp in here and spaghetti, tomatoes. Let's just try a shrimp. Oh, that's good. That tastes meaty. 
It's nice and tender. It's actually really good. It looked really good, and it smelled good when she was putting everything together. The spaghetti is actually nice, al dente. I mean, it's it's pre like car cooked when they freshen it up. This is actually really good. Here's the birria ramen I got next to the Thai seafood soup and the roasted salmon. Because it's really tender piece of beef right on top. Yeah. Super soft. Okay, I'm gonna try just the beef right now. Ooh. Okay. Ooh. Really tender, really good flavor. Mm. It's a thicker noodle. It's chewy. It's chewy. I, let me see if I can get it all together now. One bite. Some bivia and some noodles. Separately, they're good. Together, excellent. Really nice. Good flavor. I'm glad I started with this. All right, we got our water and iced tea. This is our go-to drinks for any buffet. Let's try this pizza. I've been so excited. This looks like the perfect slice of pizza. And buffet pizza can be hit or miss, but when it's good, it can be good. And this looks good. It's good. All right. It's quite cheesy tasting. I like the size of the slice. It's not too big, not too small. The crust is a little soft. Okay. I like a soft pizza crust. This might be a little too soft, but it's still very good for a buffet. Yeah. <laughs> now I've still got some meat to eat. We actually have the same cut of beef right mm -hmm. here, but yours was finished off on the grill. Yeah. Just gonna try that and Let's see try how that. what you taste because I have a really good just char grilled flavor yeah. perhaps from finishing it off on the grill. Yeah. I don't know. I thought that was good. I thought it, the taste was really nice. I'm getting really smoky flavor from mine. Yeah that's what the grill that's the magic of the grill. I know. <laughs> Alright let me try this. It's sirloin. This is definitely a little more on the rare side but it looks pretty good. Maybe like a medium. Mm -hmm. Medium rare. At the end it toward the other end it's a little more well so we'll, we'll try it both. That's juicy. Yeah. It's actually quite juicy. Yeah, your cut is a little thicker than mine. Mine is very thick. He cut yeah. it extremely thick, yeah. but that's great. Let me try a real thick part, more well done at the end here. Yeah. It's like we have two very different cuts <laughs> yeah. of the same, same type of beef. Mm. No, because mine is thinner and it's finished on the grill, so mine's a little bit more well. The well done edge of mine? actually it has a little more flavor it's not as juicy because it's cooked more but i actually maybe it's the rub on the outside mm -hmm. but i can definitely taste a lot more flavor on that end piece even though it's not quite as tender it still has a good okay a good flavor for okay. sure now, that roasted chicken it didn't say what type of spices were on it or anything i just grabbed a piece it looks like i have a thigh I really like the seasoning on this. I wish I knew what it was. So it was <laughs> yeah. It's very uh, smoky. Almost feels like an achiote pepper seasoning. It's just very red. The thighs, of course, are really nice and moist. This is good. I like it. I didn't see any fried chicken or anything like that, but the roasted oh, chicken. You're right. We didn't see any fried chicken, no. but we haven't looked at the whole no, buffet. Haven't. I really love turkey. It's one of my favorite meats, and I'm so glad they always have it on most of these buffets. Sure. I know some people don't like it, think it's dry. Sometimes it can be. But I really love the flavor, so let's see how it is here. Okay. A little dry. Okay. I should have put gravy on it. Yeah. We did have a gravy there available. It's okay. Let's try the salmon. This has some kind of sauce or mm -hmm. gravy on it. Let's see how that is. It's over rice. Rice, yeah. Rice pilaf. It's fine. 
but I really love this spaghetti. I don't know if it's the first thing I had or because I, I filled it up with shrimp, but so far this is my favorite. Now we have more food stations to explore here at the Ace Buffet, including the revival section. This is kind of the healthy food, like baba ganoush, hummus, tabbouleh salad, fatouche salad, and even little little pita triangles here. This is this is called chop suey, chop suey, and this is crispy chili soy tofu. Oh, I'm trying that. You gonna try that? Yeah, I'm gonna try that. This I is guess the, everything this is like here veg is uh, vegetarian. Vegetarian, yeah. right? Got some wild rice and some quinoa. That does look okay. Oh, oh, look, there we go. I knew there was something probably missing from the middle, the roasted Brussels sprouts. sprouts. I'll get a little of this, because since it was just brought out. Yes, fresh. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. The next station is called World Pan, and this is where we got some more shrimp over here. It looks like some you don't even have to peel. I was going to say peel and eat, but there's not even any peeling involved. It's just eating. Just the eating. <laughs> I'll get, get some. get some of those? Yeah, I'll get some of those. And we've got some dim sum, shrimp and chive dumplings. Those look good. They're so green. Look at these. You want to get some of these? Oh, I like those. Do you want some? Or yes, do you... please. You oh, get okay. some for me. That'd be great. Of course. And this says shrimp and ginger dumpling. Again, beautiful. That is so pretty. There's the remains of some bok choy there. They've got salt and pepper Ooh. chicken wings. I'm gonna try that because I love salt and pepper anything. And, I, and beef curry, I, I like beef curry. So essentially this may be the only fried chicken we're gonna get here, so I guess you better grab me one of those. Okay, would that you one. like a? Just whatever looks the meatiest. Okay. Not that one. Not <laughs> like, yeah, that one. Okay, let me Perfect. grab that one for Thank you. Thank you. And we've got some egg rolls or spring rolls, as they are labeled here on the buffet. Hey. Vegetable pancit. Okay, I feel like I need to try the pancit. Yes, it is Filipino. It is Filipino. Some vegetable fried rice right mm -hmm. here. And then we've got seaweed salad. Hey. Thai cucumber salad. Oh, this is a lot of poke. <laughs> and a lot <laughs> of spicy tuna poke. I don't think I've ever seen that much poke in a bowl before. That's a big bowl of poke. Yeah, I'm gonna have to try this too. Okay. There's actually a big container of rice here, courtesy of the Rice Master. But I'm fine. Oh, is this my plate so that far? Is your plate. Yes, yeah, I guess I need to load mine up a little more. <laughs> now we're already back here at the carvery. It's cleared out a little bit. There, I see the roasted chicken Ooh. and the collard greens. Oh, I need mashed potatoes. Oh, yes. I meant to get some mashed potatoes yeah. last time. Mm -hmm. Let's go get some brisket and we'll come back yeah. and get the mashed potatoes because we got to go all the way to the end here to the smoke and fire section for the brisket. Oh, beef brisket. Oh God. That looks incredible. It does look incredible. And that pork shoulder looks pretty good right here too. Oh yeah. I have to get a second plate for myself. Oh, I see. Very good. Yeah, yeah. I need to fill mine up more. Yes, you do. Hi, how are you? Great. Could I please? Okay. Yes, that's great. Can I also get some pork shoulder too? Please. Thank you. Great. Thank you. Uh, just brisket. Yeah, I'm gonna skip oh, the pork your... today. I'm yeah, gonna yeah. get the brisket. Okay. That's great. Uh, Thank one you. One each, please. Oh, Thank you very much. Those sweet potatoes look good. I guess I can get those too, since I'm gonna get some mashed potatoes. I might as well get some sweet yeah, potatoes. Exactly. Thank you. All right, and then we'll come back to the sweet and light desserts in a moment. All right, mashed potatoes, maybe a little, little gravy, just a little bit of gravy, not too much. Okay, great. I only have a tiny slice of brisket here, but the smell is incredible. This roast smell and the rub. I cannot wait to try this, so I'm not gonna wait. Let's try yes. the brisket. It smelled really good over at that station. <laughs> yes, and your plate is full of it, and this whole table smells incredible right now. Yes. Here we go. Mm -hmm. Is that good? Mm -hmm. 
I'm getting flavors from all corners of my mouth, all parts of this brisket. Mm -hmm. There's flavor on the rub, the flavor of the meat, the flavor of the fat. This is incredible. This is now my favorite thing on the buffet. <laughs> See how this looks? The rub looks great. It smells really great. I'm going to try the little piece with some fat and some meat as well. Let's get a little of everything. I'm excited. I'm really excited about this. Oops. Okay. Let's try this here. That is really smoky. Very smoky. Really good. Yeah. That seasoning, that rub. It's is, potent. It's so good. It's definitely one of the best. Yeah. It's really solid. And they'll, they'll even make tacos. Oh, yeah. All right. I got my salt and pepper chicken wing. This is the closest I'm going to get to fried chicken on this buffet. Let's give it a taste. That is juicy Ooh. and crispy. Mm. And salty. I hope so. So that's pansit. Mm -hmm. It's a Filipino noodle dish. Mm -hmm. How is That's it really here? good. Is it good here? That's really good. Yeah. You can see it's not like a very saucy yeah. noodle dish, but the sauce that's there, I can taste like there's like a little fish sauce. Like all the components are there. Like it has the right flavor. Okay. That's, whoever's making that did a really great job because it tastes just like vegetable pansit. All right. Like uh, that I've had growing up. Okay, well now next to that is the spicy tuna poke. Yes. Okay. See if that the tastes big, like, see if that has the right flavors. Yeah, from the biggest poke bowl I've ever seen. Yeah. Ooh. It was spicy. It is spicy. Oh. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's a lot. That, oh, wow. That's spicier than I thought it was going to be. That, wow. Is it too spicy? It's not too spicy. It's just, there, you have a spicy tuna. Like, an, an, like a, a spicy tuna roll. A spicy tuna roll. It's like a chunky. It's above that. It's oh, just it's above higher that. than that? It's hotter than okay. that. Okay. I'm, I'm intrigued. They said it was a crispy soy chili tofu, I think. Something oh, yeah. like that. Oh, yeah. Because there's so, no sauce or anything. No sauce. There are no sauces over there. So I have to try this. Mmm. It's okay. All right. I got two different colors, two different flavors of dim sum here. It's the orange one. I think that was the ginger one. It's sort of like a shrimp paste inside, something Ooh. like that. Okay. Let's try the green one. Okay, that was shrimp and chive, I believe. Yeah, a little more chive flavor. They're fine. I can't resist a little shrimp cocktail. These are ready to go. I don't have to peel anything. They're just ready to eat. They're also nicely cleaned. I like that. Let's give it a try. It's just what I want. Classic shrimp cocktail. Yeah. Really clean. Nice bright flavor on the cocktail sauce. It looks nice and plump like the ones I had in my Spaghetti. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's about the same size as the one in your spaghetti at the pasta station. Yeah, so the shrimp, is, shrimp is pretty good here. Yeah, it's a good size considering it's fully cooked. It's a good size. Yeah. Oh yeah. Okay, one more thing here. I have the roasted Brussels sprouts. Oh yeah. And they brought this out fresh when I picked this up. Mmm. Mmm. There's good flavor. It's. It's good flavor. It's like it's almost there. If it was a little more roasted, yeah, a little yeah. more caramelized, yeah, I'd like it even more. Yeah, it's it's a good starting flavor. I mean, nobody likes Brussels sprouts anyway. <laughs> <laughs> really, just let's be honest. <laughs> now, of course, amidst all this meat, there is a salad bar. It is quite a large salad bar. Let's take a look at what they have here. It literally goes all the way around mm -hmm. this whole center area. 
Here are your various salad dressings and toppings. And here's some chunks of fruit. <laughs> and here's some bread. Some assorted breads, if you're so inclined. Oh, here's, here's soups over here oh, as well. Oh, I've got yeah, but chef's, chef's choice. choice. Let's see what it looks like. That like looks like a broccoli. Like a cheddar, broccoli. Okay, broccoli that's cheddar. not my choice. That's the chef's <laughs> choice. This is minestrone. Minestrone okay. looks so good. Okay. This is tortilla soup. Maybe here. Oh, oh that's a popular. popular. <laughs> oh, it's almost empty. Okay, here's some there's, spoons. Oh, there's your soup bowls. Yes. And there's some prepared salads. Yeah, here and then, of course, the salad bar. So here's an artichoke salad, orzo pasta salad, mm -hmm. broccoli cheddar bacon salad, gamelli salad, uh, this is potato salad, three bean salad, tortilla chips, which I guess could be a salad. Oh, but it goes with aguachile. Oh, the aguachile. There you Ooh. go. So you put the, that with the chips. Okay. okay. Yeah, I've got to try a little of the aguachile. Okay. Okay, let me get a little here. I didn't know this was here. Get a little. I'm gonna get some chips with that as well. Just... Okay. Okay. And a classic wedge Ooh. salad. These actually look pretty good. They do. Love a wedge. And then the actual salad bar right up here in front where you can actually get your lettuces, your arugula, the Caesar mix, spinach, and a spinach and strawberry mix. I don't really see the strawberries. I guess it's but little dried strawberries yeah, in there, freeze, I guess. Yeah, it's like a freeze-dried. And then you got some more vegetables to add, tomatoes, cucumbers, onions, and mm -hmm. carrots. And then you're back to the salad dressings. That's where we started. So that's quite a lot of salad fixings yes. and fruit and bread. I wanted to try the Thai seafood curry at the hearth. Oh, that's right. Mm -hmm. Thai curry. Let's try it. Okay. I, it had it caught my eye before, but there's no bowl here. Yeah, the bowls are over the it. salad bar. Yeah. yeah. Pro tip. Oh, it's, yeah. Oh, it's, it's, it's shallow. It's much more shallow oh, yeah. than I thought. Thai seafood curry. Okay. I do. I see some seafood in All there. Right. Okay, let's try some of this. It looks good. So, so we'll try a little. Yeah. That's how we feel about it. We get a little more saw. Let's see. Okay. I actually want to try some of this stromboli oh, okay. that they put out over here. Okay. Try a little of this. Look at that nice cheese. A lot of cheese there. <laughs> and I also want to try, of course, more brisket. Yeah. Brisket, please. Thank you very and much. And the tacos, are they just on a corn tortilla when you said the made to order tacos? Oh, okay. Like two, two, two. two tacos. Two, two tacos, please. Oh. Oh. Oh, okay. Oh, wow. Like a secret pot of meat. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. And we got some some salsas. Uh-huh. I'm going to try... Yeah, put some on your taco. Maybe I'll try the salsa verde right Ooh, here. Okay. I'll split it on one here. Okay. That looks like something too spicy, yeah. or it could be a barbecue sauce, because right. it I'm, still says it's barbecue sauce. Is it? I'm going to have mine plain. I just want to try it just All right. for me. All right, so we got the tacos from the brisket section, and it's not actually brisket in the tacos. It's beef, some kind of beef. Looks like this. <laughs> so let's try it with a little salsa verde on the corn tortilla. Maybe there's a flour tortilla, actually, now that I think, I think of it, it's a yeah, small flour, flour tortilla. It's flour. Tastes good to me. Okay. How's the salsa verde? It's great. The only thing that would make this better is if I put brisket in it. I, you know, I was really thinking it was going to be a brisket taco too. I think without a doubt the best meat here at the Ace Buffet at the Palms is the brisket. Over in the salad section, the greenery, they had the aguachile with the chips. Now I have to try this. I didn't know this was there. Feel and taste very meaty. 
the flavor is really nice and light. That's nice. I like that a lot. I see a, a shrimp in, in that curry. It doesn't look as big as the other ones. No, it does not. But it's a mixture of seafood in there, right? Yes. This is a Thai seafood curry. Very good flavor. Very good coconut flavor. This is tasty too. I like this. I imagine if I got a bigger bowl with more seafood in it. The seafood I did try. There's like little tiny scallops yeah. in this as well. And they do have a giant pot of rice over there. They do. If you want to go with your curry. That would. This would be really good over rice. Yeah. Easily very good over rice. But I like the heat. I like the flavor of this. I'm very impressed. Very impressed. All right. It is not over yet. It is actually that time at last. Dessert. And the sweet and light section is where we're gonna find this dessert. Let's get at the end of the line. They've got Dole soft serve and looks like vanilla and pineapple, I'm guessing. Is that that's the close I can get to a Dole whip? Great. Oh yeah, maybe it is like a Dole it whip. It is like a Dole Could you whip. Just pour me some of the vanilla. Of that's funny, thank you. You're welcome. All right, okay. thank you very much. You're welcome. I'm gonna go for the, if this is the pineapple one. Looks great. Oh, that is swirl. Darn it, that would've been good too. Oh. Uh, okay. It's all right. They got some bread pudding under here, some peach cobbler. Some cherry buckle cherry pie. Cherry buckle pie, that sounds like some old fashioned. It does. And the main attraction is the ice cream right down here. Fresh hand scooped. So they got double chocolate chip, banana, dulce de leche, sea salt caramel, different sorbets. They even have an ube purple yam flavor down there and a spumoni. Hi. Hi. How are you? Hi. Can I try the ube? Oh, you beat me to it. Oh, you want, the, you want the ube? I also want ube. Well, you can get, we can both have ube. Yeah, it's we fine. can both have it. We'll both oh, have it. How about, can I get a strawberry sorbet also? Strawberry? Yeah. Uh, awesome. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Could I get the ube and the spumoni, please? And they do have pies and cakes and cookies. Muffins and... Puddings. We have Jello. The Jello looks. Oh my so God! Cute. I got Jello. That looks incredible. I love Jello. Can I'm gonna grab one. Yes, for you? please. Can I put some orange Jello or on red? My Can I have one of each? Okay. One. Orange. There's a yellow one too back there. Okay. That's fine. Thank Hi. you. Great. And these look pretty good. That's like some kind of strawberry and cream. And oh, it's like a strawberry shortcake. I like a creme soft. brulee too. Hey. I'll try the strawberry one. Mm. Like some kind of jello shots. <laughs> it's like minus the whipped cream. Minus the liquor. And I'll get <laughs> I'll get a creme brulee one too. It wasn't labeled, but this is a faint yellow color. I'm hoping it's pineapple, like a Dole Whip. Because the machine did say Dole Soft Serve, didn't it? Yeah. Sorry, let's try this out. That's totally it. It's like a Dole Whip? It's a Dole Whip. Wow. Oh, look, I'm not even standing in line for the Chanta Tiki room or anything. This is great. Let's try this ube flavor in here. I know we both got ube. Yeah. But I have some spumoni underneath. But let's see what this ube flavor is like. Just right up. It's very mellow. It's very like a nice vanilla adjacent flavor. That's good. Camera says a little creme brulee treat here. A, I don't know if you can hear it. You probably can. <laughs> As I'm tapping it near the microphone. There's still a little crispy caramelized shell on top, so that's good. Okay. Mm. It's still crunchy on top. Yeah. Oftentimes when we're at buffets and you see the creme brulee, it's been sitting. Yeah. It doesn't retain that caramelized yeah. brulee top. This has it. Very happy. Mm. All right, now I want to try this strawberry sorbet. Okay. It does look good. Usually I get ice cream, gelato, not so often the sorbet, but this time it's looking pretty good. Oh, that 
it's so good. It's so strawberry and so smooth. Mm. It looks good. The texture looks nice. It's as good as it looks. It's mm. really good. Okay. Let me try this ube. Your ube was underneath. Yeah. Yeah, it has a faint, you said a faint vanilla flavor. Yeah. I, I feel like it's a faint potato flavor. <laughs> Ube is like a potato, a it purple a, yam of yes, some it sort. Is a yam. But it's very faint. You're right, it's almost like not much flavor at all because it's a potato. Yeah. They, they, they've done their best making it taste like a potato with a hint of vanilla, I'd yeah. say. Yeah, it's not a strong flavor. It has a very nice color though, enhanced. <laughs> the color is the best part. The color is the best part. Vanilla is my favorite flavor of everything, so the vanilla soft serve. Every time it's good. No matter where you get vanilla ice cream in any form whatsoever, it's good. Now let me try these jello shots here. Okay. Red flavor. Oh, you lost. Lost my cherry. Oh darn. Oh. Oh, worth it though. That that's a phenomenal cherry flavor Jello. Okay. I haven't had Jello Jello in ages, but I'm gonna start having it all the time now. <laughs> like seriously, this is so good. You get that the brisket, and I'll get the pineapple Dole Whip. Yeah. So I think my my three favorite foods here. <laughs> Was the brisket, the shrimp pasta, and the Jello, nice. cherry Jello? I'd say that's pretty much the best of the Ace Buffet here at the Palms in Las Vegas. Hey, thanks for watching, everybody. Please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it, and be sure to subscribe for more because there's always more to eat when it's all you can Vegas. <laughs>